What's up, guys? That's what Seth said here. Uh, today, I'm going to be going over uh, the top five things that are happening in the world right now. Uh, this is a new thing that I am going to be getting started. Hopefully, it goes well. Um, just let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. And so, uh, first, we're going to start with ISIS. Uh, so, it is an Islamist militia group. Uh, they have actually seized a large chunk of land uh, stretching from northern Syria to uh, central Iraq. So, that is a lot. And to a lot of our leaders in the United States, they have struck a fear to them. Um, now, this group, they did, they did begin in 2004 in a city in Iraq, al Qaeda, something like that. I know I'm definitely saying it wrong. Um, and then this group is actually allied with uh, Osama bin Laden. And I'm sure you all know who that is. And this group is also the people who attacked Paris. So next, what we're going to be talking about is the Calif California's drought. Um, uh, now, we do know it's been going on for hundreds of years, obviously. But right now, it is worse than ever. Uh, farmers, their wells are completely empty, nothing they can go off of. Uh, most farmers have to wait a very long time to get their water. And some companies are actually helping the people who can't pay for that uh, to get to them. Uh, they're helping them with that, with free water. Next, we're going to be talking about the Warriors. Now, Warriors is an NBA basketball team. Most sports people already know everything about this, but they are on a streak, a 23 win streak. Um, 27 if you count the last season. And so, next, North Korea. They did come out with a hydrogen bomb, and this is the first Kim has ever publicized um, the development of a weapon. So, I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. We'll definitely see in the future. Um, it is far hard for us to find out the truth. Um, because it is a secretive country. So we will find out the truth soon. And so let's talk about Trump. Trump. Um, Donald Trump. There is a lot of... There's really not much to say about him because everyone has their own opinions, good or bad. Uh, there is one thing that we do know. He is. He's not like most candidates. He's more like a businessman than a president. Um, you know, I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing, but we'll definitely see in the future where that goes. And so, uh, yeah, that's everything that I have, the top five. I'm going to be coming out with more of these soon. And... Um, that's what Seth said, and so you guys have a good day. Bye.